What's up, everybody? Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook here at the 2019 NFL Scouting Combine. Day one, coaches and GMs were speaking today at the podium. So here's some of the sights, some of the sounds, and a lot of what they said today. Here it is. Wow. How you guys doing? How y'all doing? I used to do that down in Carolina. They didn't believe for one moment that I was from there. <laughs> um, welcome to the Underwear Olympics. It's good to see everybody. Um, you know, we're in the roster building season, Pat. There's no off season anymore, in case you had, you weren't aware of it. Uh, we're in the roster building season. <clears throat> we don't play until September. I've checked the schedule, and uh, so that's uh, there's, there's going to be a lot of. There's a lot of time to make a lot of decisions. So I just want everybody to understand that. Just as a reminder, I'm not going to di discuss negotiations. I'm not going to discuss timelines. To me, as far as I'm concerned, that's a very personal um, between the club and the, and the player. So don't don't ask. Don't waste your time. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll say this. It's a repeat of what I said at my postseason presser. Uh, we didn't sign Odell to trade him. Okay, so I know that's all over the place. So understand that, and that's the, all I need to say about that. And then the other thing, I was, I was here listening to the questions you guys were asking, Pat. And you know, a lot, a lot, a lot of, the, a lot of times we focus on numbers. Okay, how big a guy is, how fast a guy is, how strong a guy is. What's his vertical jump? How tall is he? What's his hand size? What's his arm length? There's all these, just a myriad of numbers, an analytics delight, okay, of numbers. You know, one of the things that, that we really focus on is instincts, okay? Instincts are very important. You know, you ask, you guys were asking Pat the question about the quarterback, about the quarterbacks, and you know, you, you can write a laundry list of things you're looking for, and it's, it's not like you're breaking new ground and it's not like you're splitting atoms, okay? But one of the things that I focus on and, and my staff and we talk about all the time is instincts. Does he have a feel for the game? You know, is he, play, is he, is he a step ahead of everybody else? Instincts and play smarts allow you to play bigger, stronger, faster. That's a fact of life. So, you know, Try, you know, if you are a film watcher, when you watch it, you know, try to try to focus on that. Is this guy, does he seem to have, I, I, I was, I spent some time with an Aussie Rules um, player, pro uh, personnel guy a bunch of years ago. And in Australia, they, they say, when I was explaining what I was talking about instincts, he said, so you're saying to me, do they have the chip? That's what they call it down there. So... To answer your question about tall quarterbacks, shot quarterbacks, you know, roly-poly defensive linemen, a lot of it's instincts and, and play spots. So with all that being said, let the games begin. Do you find as though what you just said? I'm sorry? Do you feel as though what you just mentioned and talked about kind of exemplifies a player, let's say like Sam Mills, who doesn't fit all the measurables, but finds a way to make the play each and every time? And you see that with all positions? Y you do. You know, it, 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 and it's really funny. You know, obviously, you know, and I've said it before, it, it's a big man's game. You know, you talk about it all you want. You know, the game's changing and everybody's, you know, going crazy about all the stuff the college guys are doing. Bottom line is it's a big man's game. So if you don't have size, if you're missing a, a PQ, a physical quality, so to speak, instincts can, instincts can it's, you, you have to have a, what I call a compensating factor. Okay, and the compensating factor can a lot of times is instinct. Sam Mills was 5'9", may he rest in peace, was 5'9", on his, you know, in, in high heel sneakers. But he, he could find the ball. The other day I was watching Luke. I was watching Carolina defensive film, and I was watching Luke, and I'm just saying to myself, I mean, he's, it's like he's in the huddle. It's amazing. You know, so, and, and that, it's, that doesn't, that doesn't just apply to a defensive player. It applies to every position on the field. 